Hello, hello, and welcome to another Stamp with Amy K Facebook Live video. And I'm just uh, decided that, uh, well, the nice UPS man just showed up today, a few minutes ago, with some sneak peek items from the new Ornate Garden Suite. So this is a suite of products that's available for demonstrators to order now, um, pre-order now and it will be available for customers to order beginning on April 1st. Um, but the one little bonus and the reason I wanted to show you all this is because um, if you're interested in joining, you can actually add these items to your starter kit and there are some good ones. So I think you're definitely gonna, <laughs> gonna be interested in that. So um, I'm hopping on totally unannounced uh, just because I didn't know when my package of stuff was gonna get here, but just wanted to um, show you this really quickly. So again, this is the Ornate Garden Suite, and uh, this is going to be from, or this is from the upcoming annual catalog. So you'll see these items in the annual 2020 to 2021 Stamp It Up annual catalog. That's a lot to say. That's a lot of 20s. So. So this is a new product suite that Stampin' Up! is releasing early for us. So again, demonstrators can order it now, and um, customers can order it beginning April 1st, and they will you'll be able to order it through May 31st, and um, then the new annual catalog should, should start shortly after that. So, so again, these are available um, for, if you're interested in joining, you can definitely add these items to your starter kit. So good, very good deal. So you can order the whole suite to, as a, um, like a whole big bundle for $136.75, or you can order the individual pieces as well. Hey, Jean, welcome from North Dakota. So, um, so this is, there is a flyer. I've got it. Um, I put it in my newsletter, and I'll post it on my blog tomorrow, stampwithamyk.com. Um, but that's got all the information, lots of pictures, um, some pretty samples, and that sort of thing from Stampin' Up. But I actually have the product here in my sweaty little hands. So I thought I would run through and show you guys what I got today from the UPS guy. <laughs> well, from Stampin' Up, UPS guy showed up a few minutes ago uh, because I did happen to press that overnight button and it, I have that darn sticky key on my computer and I seem to always overnight these these uh, <laughs> new new products just because I'm always so excited to get them and show everybody. So this is the one of the stamp sets in this um, suite of products. Again, all the, the products are available individually, or you can purchase it as the full product suite, just like, um, just actually, Jean, I think I did figure out what the new color is going to be. Well, I'm going to do the paper in a bit, but you'll see. I think I know which one it is. <laughs> so yay, I'm excited about it. It's a pretty color too. Um, so this is the ornate style stamp set, and um, so lot you know pretty floral images, so good one. And then it is bundled with the ornate layers dies, and these are beautiful. Um, it's a bunch of really detailed framed images, and then we've got um, just some that that will cut the floral images into the paper, so you can use them as little background ones. So I'll hold these up for a second. Hopefully you can get a good look at those. Um, so again, the, the images in here, there aren't specific dies to cut out the flower images, but you can stamp the flower images and cut around them with the really pretty frames. So I'm very, very excited. I love the frames, they're beautiful. So um, definitely a good, this is bundled together again. So it's the stamp set, the ornate style stamp set and the, I'm gonna forget the names of them, ornate layers dies. Um, so these are bundled together, um, but again, you can purchase them individually as well. And then the next stamp set we have is, and dies, and I, I did a bunch of die cutting with these, so I'll <laughs> kind of scoot the die cuts towards the bottom just because I wanted to show you what everything looked like. So, hey, Joy, thanks for hopping in. Glad you're here today. So this is the Ornate Thanks Photopolymer Stamp Set, which, again, this is a really good font. I mean, I love the... the um, the sentiments, I love the fonts. I can always use thank you stamps and hopefully everybody else can too. I'm sure everybody needs thank you cards as much as I do. Um, so again, lots of good good sentiments in here. It's a photopolymer. So you can see through, makes for easy stamping. Oh, and I guess I forgot to show, it is, it's red rubber on the, the previous one, the ornate uh, style, the one with the flowers in it is a red rubber stamp. So, all right, so we have this, um, the ornate thanks is our stamp set. And then we've got the ornate borders dies, which are here. Um, and I'll show you, this is what they look like when they're gonna come in. Oh, I guess I should turn it so you can see them a little easier. Um, these are all border dies, which is very cool. Um, this one actually cuts like a, a full, 
um, I don't know, I don't even know how to, it's not, this one's not a border dye, it cuts, I'll show you in a second, I guess, um, it cuts the image actually out, and then there are flowers that you can die cut in different colors and layer over the top, so it's a, it's an awesome die set, so let me show you what it cuts. So this is actually this die cut, and it cuts a very, very pretty rose border, and then the one nice little bonus with it is, there is another die if you wanted this just to be um, all by itself, there is a die that will cut this out so that you'll just have this pretty little delicate strip of flowers, um, which I didn't cut it that way. I just cut it so that you could see what the border looked like. But again, there's a, a coordinating die that you can cut the rest of it out with. So you can just have this piece left. And then there's this one, which is, it's hopefully you can see it and I'll try to hold it still. Uh, the bottom die down here on the die set, which is a bunch of little, um, it's like a little scalloped edge with little uh, holes in it. I don't know, is that the right? Yeah, so <laughs> so it's a, got the little stitched edge there and then little scalloped edge border with it. So definitely a good one. And then we have this one, which is another sort of scallop border, and that is this die cut right here. And again, I didn't cut these very nicely. I just grabbed some cardstock scraps that I had and ran it through my die cutting machine. So <laughs> they'll look much prettier on cards, but I just wanted to, to cut it so that you could kind of get the general idea of how these worked and what they look like. And then we have this one is the next one that I'm going to show you. Oops, I got a little. All right. So this one cuts a really cool floral border. Hey, Rosemary, I'm glad that you're here. Thanks for joining. So this one cuts a really cool floral border. And it probably is easier to see if I flip it over. So this you can have peeking out along the edge of your card. So it's very cool. And then the, it actually cuts these parts, these parts, <laughs> this piece of the die um, actually cuts out little, um, I don't know, it's like the negatives of the, the leaves, which I think you could also use. Um, but it's designed to be used just as a border die. But like I said, I think you could add these back in um, or use them in a totally different way. But uh, definitely some some good good stuff, good good set of dies. So, and then the last die here is this one, and this is the one I was trying to. I, I don't know what the word is. I'm sure there's a term for it, but it basically cuts out the strip of flowers as opposed to just a border like the rest of them cut. Um, so that is this die in the set. So, but yes, I love the dies. Definitely a good 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 set of dies. Good, both of them are good sets of dies and good stamp sets too. So. All right, next up, we have a new embossing folder, and I did emboss a piece of cardstock, and I'll hold it up closer so hopefully you can see it. This is the Ornate Floral 3D Embossing Folder. I'm gonna hold this up close so hopefully you can get a good view of what it looks like on the screen. And then obviously this is the embossing folder, um, which is, it's one of the 3D embossing folders. And then this is what the cardstock looks like. I'm trying to catch a good, good light on it, so hopefully you can see it, and I'll hold it still. Um, so this is what the embossing folder looks like when you emboss. It's it's a pretty delicate little flower. It's uh, it is it's really pretty. So, all right, I agree, Stacy. It's I mean the whole suite is beautiful. So, all right, next up we have some ribbon, and it's a ribbon combo pack. Hey, Lisa, thanks for hopping in. So yes, it's the embossing folder is really pretty. Um, so we have the ornate garden ribbon combo pack and old olive and calypso no old olive and um terracotta tile i believe are the colors of course i should have looked that up before i hopped on here but uh yeah but it's terracotta tile and old olive that um is in this ribbon combo pack very pretty um kind of delicate ribbon which is going to tie nice bows so definitely another good pack of ribbon that we've got good morning yes Oh, thanks, and thanks for sharing the video. I appreciate that. So, um, all right, next thing we have are the Gilded Gems, and these are very similar to the gems that are in the current, um, I guess it's probably easier to see it on white. Um, so they're, in, they're very similar to the ones that are in the Valentine Suite in the current catalog, only the one huge bonus, I think, to these is they are self-adhesive, and... Um, they're, they're not super flat, but they're also not much thicker than a rhinestone. Maybe the bigger one's a little thicker than a rhinestone. So I think you'll still be able to mail them, particularly with the smaller ones on there. So that's always good for card making stuff. But again, these are the Gilded Gems and they are gold. If that doesn't show up well on, on screen, I'm not sure how well you can see them. But um, 
oh, did I hit the overnight button? No, I just live right next to Stampin' Up! Not. <laughs> of course I hit the overnight button accidentally, of course. It happens, you know, I just, it happens. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. All right, so this is the Ornate Garden Specialty Designer Series Paper. And the colors in it are Bumblebee, which I believe is the yellow that's in here, uh, the darker yellow, I should say. I think it's, I think it's this darker yellow in here. I'm pretty sure that's the new color. <laughs> so I'm assuming with the color named Bumblebee that it would be a yellow color. But um, the other colors in this pack are Early Espresso, Mint Macaron, Old Olive, Terracotta Tile, and Whisper White. So um, this is, again, it's the Ornate Garden Specialty Designer Series paper. It's a 12 by 12 pack, again, like our standard one, two sheets, double-sided. So this is the first side of one of them, and um, the flowers are beautiful on here. And then you flip it over, and it's gold foiled flowers on the back. So very, very, very pretty. I'll try to hold it still and hopefully catch the light right so that uh, you can see those. This is the early release stuff, Catherine. So, yep, you definitely need to hop on and get ordering this stuff if you haven't done it yet. <laughs> so, I'm glad that you uh, like the video or like the stuff, Julie. It's it's really a good, 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 good set of products. So, um, here's another floral piece of designer paper, and then you turn it over, and it is mint macaron and gold foiled on the back. So again, I'll try to hold it somewhat still so you can sort of see the pattern in it and um, hopefully catch some of the gold foiling. And then we have this one, which is another pretty floral design. And then the back side of it has also got the gold foiled flowers on it, which are beautiful. I think this one will be fun to color too. Um, maybe just pick out a couple of individual flowers and color them for a background or something like that. So definitely very, very pretty. Yes, Catherine, I, you are in trouble. So, <laughs> but, um, so this is the, uh, one of the other patterns in it. And this is the back side, which has got the gold foiling and some old olive on it, which is very pretty. This isn't available till the 1st of April, so you've got a little time for your credit card to recover after celebration, and then you'll be able to order this <laughs> So for customer orders. However, if you're interested in joining, you can actually um, get you can add these items to your starter kit. So if you're interested in joining as a demonstrator, drop me a note. I'd be happy to have you talk with you more about it. I can get you a copy of the flyer, and um, you can go to town on ordering your starter kit. So... Um, this is the other side, the opposite side. No foiling on this piece of paper. And then this is the last sheet of paper in here. Um, this is old olive on one side and then pretty, pretty flowers on the other side. So that is it for the um, Ornate Garden Suite. And yes, the demonstrators can order this now. So if you are interested in joining, if you're not already a demonstrator and interested in joining, um, definitely definitely uh, drop me a note. I'd be happy to talk with you more about it. So it's a great time to join. You also, you get the celebration bonus where you get the, the little mini paper trimmer, the, the um, six by six designer series paper and a stamp set of your choice for free. In addition to the $125 worth of merchandise that you get to pick for your starter kit and you only pay $99 and it ships for free. So Stampin' Up! really did definitely um, knock this one out of the park. The paper is stunning, and the dyes are amazing. And the stamps are always nice, you know, always beautiful stamps. But the dyes and the paper and the embossing folder, everything is beautiful. So it is a very, very, very good suite of products. Um, so again, if you are not a demonstrator yet, drop me a note, and I'd be happy to uh, talk to you about how you can get these products <laughs> right now. So um, definitely a good deal for joining right now. So let me know if you have any questions. I will post this video out on my YouTube page as well as on my blog tomorrow with a link to um, this flyer so you can take a closer look at it. Um, thanks so much for joining today. Hopefully you all have a great rest of your afternoon, and I will see you all soon.